Yo, it's Labor Day. That means summer is over. So let's give it a proper send off, shall we? <laughs> I thought it was gonna be sunny all day. You wanna answer a question for a video? Question. Uh, what's your favorite photo you take in the summer? Or a favorite event that you, you went to this summer? Favorite thing you've experienced? Favorite thing I've experienced? I'd say uh, Coney Island. Coney I Island? enjoy coming out to Coney Island. I usually try to come out a couple times, uh, at least a couple times in the summer. And, yeah. Uh, every time I feel like there's interesting people, very interesting situations. You had that good photo of that snake. From, snake, was yeah, that 4th yeah. of July? So I think that no, might have been the mermaid, mermaid, mermaid parade. parade. Yeah. But yeah, I, I enjoy Coney Island. Yeah. I'd say, uh, Although it's not a particular event, obviously, but uh, the Mermaid Parade was quite, quite good, I think. Still have that drink? The same one? No, I bought more. Okay. Oh, he's over there. Oh, what are you asking if he has the same? Uh, oh, shit, my camera's overheating. Oh, oh it's not even that hot. Yeah, see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's uh, just compensation oh. from Dude, looking at my photos. This looks like he's about to... You have a favorite photo you've taken this summer? Or a favorite event? This summer, I didn't actually do that. I didn't um, go to any particular events. What I actually did was spend most of my time in Midtown. That's like a shooting spree right there. Like, there's a lot of photos you can grab out of there, but it can get very dull very quick. But I chose it because I switched over to digital. That was one thing. And then I just wanted to shoot and then not think about anything. So I ended up just staying in Midtown all the summer. It was more like a, a reawakening, I guess. I'm pretty happy with what I did. And we'll see what comes out of it. Is there, is there a photo that pops out as like, Better than average. I mean, There's a lot of them favorite. actually. Yeah. I've got this lady. I think she's drunk, but in a baby crib. I've got a lot of weird ones this yeah. year. Ruben, what is your favorite photo you've taken this summer? Hey, Danny. I'm gonna need a little time. Okay. We can ask Danny too. Danny, what's your favorite photo you've taken this summer? I've taken this summer? Oh my God. Or, if you don't want to answer that, favorite event that you shot? I would say the Mermaid Parade this summer. Mermaid Parade? really great. But that was the first time I used my Rico to take like event photos and I really enjoyed it. But. I don't usually do events. It's not like my shtick. The riot in Union Square. Oh yeah, yeah. The, that giveaway. Yeah, that, that was the giveaway. That, yeah. was the that turned into the riot. That, it, that became the riot. Yeah, that was, and it was especially fun because I had no idea any of that was happening. Yeah. I just happened to be in that area, and I saw a lot of people, so I followed it. Dang. And it was definitely the most, I don't know, the most energized I felt all all summer for about four hours there. Yeah, it looked crazy. Yeah. What's up? Doing, I'm good, bro. How you I doing? Yeah, guys, like photographers and definitely Paulie B. Yeah, Paulie B. Let right. me get as close as I can. There we go, ready? Right? One, two. Dope. Hey, what's up? You gonna photo of you? Oh, yeah, that's my pop. How you doing, bro? Right. Can I get a flick? Yeah, can I do it with my son? Yeah, yeah, hell yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right, there we go. Let me get this. Get a little closer. A little closer. Yeah. Perfect. All right. Black and white. That's right. I'm going to um, send me the picture to social media. Black and white. Got last year. All right, all right. Yeah. Got you. Yeah, got you. Nice. Thank you so much. Of course. Of course. Yeah, man, all right. Sonia, Will, favorite photo or event that you shot this summer? Mid-Autumn Festival. Mid-Autumn like, Festival. Hasn't happened yet, but it's 
happening soon? Well, I haven't developed any film this entire summer. Okay. So, uh, I don't know. I haven't taken a good photo. Maybe I have, maybe I haven't. But uh, before I got here, I was living in Toronto, and me and my homies, we shot Toronto Pride. It was just a good time. Yeah. You know? Like, we just had a great time shooting pictures, so. Yeah. Shout nice. out to Toronto. Yo, we got Isael here. Isael, summer's over. What was your favorite photo you've taken in the past three months? One of them, it was like a hardcore show I went a couple of weeks ago in Tom Tonkin Square Park. Oh, yeah, I saw so that. So it's like this young dude, like, he have like the skinhead style, like very old school. So he's in the middle, like doing the traditional, you know, like dance, like. So I really like the photo because it, it looks like from back in the day in my mind. I think you need the streets to succeed the industry. It's been a long summer and I've been on my grind. I think you need the streets to succeed the industry. It's been a long summer and I've been on my grind. I think you need the streets to succeed the industry. I think you need the streets to succeed the industry. It's been a long summer and I've been on my grind. It's been a long summer and I've been on my grind. That night over his I'm impressed. Where do you get your film from? Where do you get it developed? Do you develop at home? Who develops your film? Do you like it? Gelatin Labs develops my film. And you should get your film developed at Gelatin Labs too. I mean, look at the scan. Now let's zoom into the scan. And let's zoom in some more to the scan. I mean, come on, look at this. Use the link in the description of this video to send your film to Gelatin Labs today. I know you got film from the summer, so get all that developed soon. Sent to Gelatin Labs now. We're asking every photographer what their favorite photo was from the summer, if you want to answer it. What's your favorite photo? Um, I've covered 4th of July for years, mm -hmm. and that's a really special day in Coney Island, and I really do enjoy that. Between the hot dog eating contest, the patriotic themes, you see so many flag type of thing. Yeah. This year was a little different, and it just started pouring. Oh, oh yeah, I remember that. And photo. people running in the rain and everything. And I was I was taking shelter by uh, across from Nathan's and um, scaffolding there. And there was a family I think from Missouri. I was talking to them, and they had all their ponchos on. I yeah. brought up my camera and just started photographing them. And they did not look happy, but they did not look miserable. But they didn't expect this. Uh -huh. And I just turned to the dad, and dad's like you know what, you're creating memories here. No matter what type of thing. The dad just started laughing. That's good, you know? yeah. And I got a great picture of the daughter looking like that. They're all in their covered. And yeah. that's the thing is like, the beauty of Coney is it gives gifts. You think you've seen everything every time. And you just turn the corner and you just meet beautiful people too, so. Sam, what's the favorite photo you've taken this summer? Or a memorable one, this is your favorite. Favorite, uh, favorite feels like a lot of pressure. Uh, probably this one of this lady like looking at this cane. There's this old guy walking with like a cane, like a clear cane, and we, me and uh, Cameron like stopped him, and we were like talking to him or whatever. And then this lady comes up out of nowhere with like red hair, and she just starts looking at it, and she just holds it up, she's looking at it like this. So yeah, good story. That was good backup. Yeah, thank you. Wait, can I say two or is you can it? You say two. Oh, you can say two. Uh, one is a photo of my friend Cameron over here uh, with an e-bike on fire behind him, and he has a cigarette in his mouth. The second one is this um, this black guy holding his hands like this, and he's looking at me very tender. Those are the two. Really dapper gentleman, totally dressed up. It was like 12 o'clock at night, uh, midnight down in LES. Uh, just standing around watching everybody, and uh, this girl introduces him to her himself to her and she sticks her hand out so you can kiss it. Mm. And I caught her just like deadpan oh. behind the tree. And oh, you don't see her, you just see a hand and he's like leaning down, giving it a kiss. Awesome don't, awesome, awesome don't get no shine no more. Awesome die, awesome time, don't got no time no more. Awesome don't, awesome, awesome don't get no shine no more. Awesome die, awesome time, don't got no time no more. <laughs> Alright, come on.
There. Oh shit, yeah. wow. gonna do it for this video i right, guys catch you guys in the next one like comment subscribe and all that stuff uh follow kazu too all right bye now when they see us in the streets all they want to do is take pics and i'm like